Wow! What did you do that for? I don't like you. Why? You've started to go to my Sunday school, and I don't want you telling anyone I go there. But I haven't. Well, don't. Anna, why are you not going to school today? Jake's been building me at school. Oh, that's not right. I hope it can be sorted out. Mum's had a word with the teacher, and she's going to talk to the class about it today. Okay, I'll see you soon. I will pray for you. Oh, would you? Thanks, Sally. Boys and girls, I would like to remind you that bullying is not accepted here or anywhere else. You must be respectful of everyone in our school. Mum, why do I have to go to Sunday school? You know I don't enjoy it. It's not cool. Well, I would like you to go, son. Wait up, Anna. Why were you not at school on Friday? You were nasty to me and hurt me, so I was too upset to go. Hello, Hello, Mr. Mr. Taylor. Hello. Jesus is God's only son. And last week we saw how gentle and kind Jesus is to everyone. He has healed many people, taught people the right way to live, and how to love one another. Why did the religious leaders not like him? Didn't they bully him, Mr. Taylor? Ellie, that is exactly right. I think one of Jesus' disciples was paid a lot of money to betray him. Yes, his name was Judas. How could Judas do that? Sometimes we don't understand why people do such bad things. Jake, can you tell me something bad the soldiers did to Jesus? Yes, Mr. Taylor. They beat him up. That's right, Jake. And we're going to talk about that now. Let's watch and see what happens. The religious leaders were jealous of Jesus and worried about people following him and believing what he taught. I see the scribes and Pharisees are gathered in the crowd again today. The people, they want to make Jesus king. They all like Jesus. Look at him, showing love and kindness to everyone. I'm fed up with Jesus always speaking the truth. People aren't even listening to us anymore. The only way we can change what's going on is to tell lies about Jesus to the Romans. We need to grab him when there are less people about. This is our only chance. Look, the crowds are going home and it will be dark soon. According to Judas, Jesus is on his own just with the disciples in the Garden of Gethsemane. Get the soldiers ready. Judas, take us straight to Jesus. Soldiers, are you ready? Quick march. Why do they want to arrest Jesus when all he did was the kindest things? He's here. I told you he'd be here. Who are you looking for? Jesus of Nazareth. That's me. Peter is attacking the servant of the high priest. Don't worry, he is healing the man's ear now. Boys and girls, it's not right to hurt anyone. Did you know that the Bible says our tongue, although it's a little part of our body, it can be like a sword and do real damage to people's lives? We must be very careful what we say to everyone because we could really hurt somebody's feelings. Why didn't Jesus fight back? Because if you're being bullied, you can't solve it just by fighting back. Quick, take him and throw him into the prison. When they put Jesus in prison, they were nasty to him. They pulled his hair from his beard. And they made fun of him by putting a purple robe on him. Hail, King of Jews! Hail, the King of the Jews! Father, forgive them, for they do not know what they are doing. Boys and girls... Jesus even showed love and forgiveness to those who were bullying him. Thank you, Mr. Taylor. That was very helpful today. You're welcome, Anna. Goodbye. Anna, I have come to say I am sorry for the way I behaved at school last week. I never thought my words were hurting you and I should not have pulled your hair. There were no excuse for me behaving like that. I am so sorry. I was hurt, Jake, and that's why I didn't go to school on Friday. I was so upset, I thought we were friends. Can you forgive me? 
I didn't think I could, but after hearing how Jesus forgave those that bullied him, of course I will. Boys and girls, listen to me. You have been learning today how I was bullied, and I know it is not nice because I was badly bullied. I love and care for every one of you. You can always talk to me in prayer at any time of the day or night. I will listen and answer your prayers. Remember, every one of you is unique and special to God. I loved you so much that I died for all the wrong things you have done. If you are bullying people like I did, you need to stop and realise how you are affecting them. Ellie, you'll never guess what happened after Sunday school. What happened? Jake has said sorry for bullying me. I'm so happy. Oh, Anna, I'm so happy for you too. God is so good to answer my prayers for you. Come on, let's go and play with Jake.